Welcome back everyone, volume 22, destination F-U-C-K-E-D. These fellas have bought a luxurious bench top. Some say it's too big for the house. Others are like, no, once we get it in, it will be a perfect fit. The crane's getting tired, it wants to rest the bench on the rail. Oh, and that is the end of this renovation. Fuel is expensive in 2022. It's important not to waste it. I have nothing else to add to this video. Cycling, we know it is a common way to end up in destination fucked. He is okay. No, I spoke too soon. I don't think many people saw it. Like, way more people would see this if you were a celebrity or a public figure or someone in charge of a country. Arriving in destination F can truly catch you by surprise. Bam! First there is a door, then there is no door. As a cheeky bastard that's created hours of DF content, this is the greatest facial expression I've ever seen. It shows so many thoughts and so few thoughts all at once. Meanwhile, here's a pool minding its own business. All of a sudden there's a car where there definitely should not be a car. This is what we call Destination Fucked Atlantis. Bloody aquatic based fail videos. In rush as a tradie, he yells out, would you like a quote? Do you want a quote for me to rescue you? Then he says, nah, just kidding, I'm not an asshole. Into the water these two legends go to commence Operation Rescue Shithouse Driver. Oh, there she is. No worries. It's a feel-good Destination F story. Everyone's okay. Oh, I might need to pop up me Vegemite censorship here. Everyone says, you know you're not meant to park there. It's a pool. She replies, ha ha, yeah, very funny, and walks away to have a mid-strength beer and a Panadol after that conundrum. Thanks to Neve for sending in your workout video to aussieman.com slash submit, link below. I'm proud of you. Well done using the monkey bars to get fit and nearly break your neck. Wait for it, wait for it. You know the moment is coming, but you don't know where it's coming from. Is it the bloke in the front? Is it the bloke at the back? This sounds like I'm commentating a porno. Oh, oh there it is. The bike goes in the river. I don't know if I'd walk on this bridge with my regular feet, yet alone use a bike. This entire bridge represents destination fucked in physical form. What are you up to? What's your story? Boxing? That's a good exercise. That's not boxing. That is a discounted flash sale airfare to destination F. I can't be too harsh. Being at home with a toddler all day can scramble your brain. Yeah, no, yeah, her kid is already roasting her. And he's not even a bloody teenager yet. We often see umbrellas in this series, don't we? There's a lot of Mary Poppins wannabes out there. <laughs> oh no, streakers. It never ends well. Three, two, one, bam! Destination fucked. That was a well-executed rugby tackle by a rugby game security team. It adds up. It's interesting when people are proud of sending themselves to Destination F, isn't it? Here's a house that was for sale for almost 400 grand. Like the glass door in the video earlier, now there is no house. When change occurs, it can happen fast, in the blink of an eye. Unless someone is really passionate about living in Destination Fucked full time, I don't think this property will sell. I don't think so. Cheers for watching everyone, whack the like button to avoid destination fucked, I promise. And check out aussiemanshop.com for all your merchandise needs. The links are below to all of my shit. See ya!